Well, we just left Disappointment Falls. And it was a major disappointment. Yes. There's, um, there's a reason for that. Yep. Why? Yes. Um, it's a little bitty stream with rivulets and it kind of goes down the sides of where the falls are in the spring when there's a lot of snow melt. With, with snow melt, it will be a spectacular falls. I thought you'd talk about why your feet are so wet. Water cooling. Right. <laughs> his feet decided, whoosh, we want to be in the water. Yep. So his feet are water cooled today. Yeah. yeah. Yep. And um, I thought the trail map said three miles round trip. It's three miles one way. But so it's been nice. Yeah, it's it's been a pretty nice day. A little bit warmer than normal for this time of year up this high. But uh, <clears throat> not too bad. Nice breeze. Yeah. Yeah. So. So, not too bad of a disappointment. It was a no. There. You know, it was a, it was a great disappointment. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> a great disappointment. I like it. All right. Now we got to apparently three miles back. Yep. All right, let's go. Let's go have fun. Yeah. <clears throat> Steve, there's a dead tree. Yeah, I see it. It, not enough character in that tree. It needs to work on its character. It needs to work on its character, that tree? Yeah. That one right there? Yep. Oh. It's all nice and tall and straight and boring. We need to get a little kinks in it, a little character. A little character? A little character. Should we, should we give it Robin McIntyre's phone number? <laughs> She'll help it build character. Ooh. Yeah, we could do that. Can Robin, can you help this tree build some character? Hmm. It needs to branch out. <laughs> but I'm bum. This is a trail through the Aspen, but this particular grove is pretty bare. <laughs> We've just really been taking our time up here. We, I've tried to stop and get some audio of the Aspens for you. The quaking Aspen, it's so iconic fall in Colorado. Now, if you haven't had a chance, you can get out here and fall and get some, just kind of go into a grove of quaking aspen, aspen <laughs> and just sit for a while and listen to it. Yeah. It's very, very calming. It is. <sighs> hmm. I think we still have a couple miles back. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is so beautiful. Yep. Yeah. Well, no deer, elk, or moose, nope. but um, cows. cows. Hello, everyone. Hi. We're just gonna... Hi, friend. We're gonna walk right past you. Okay. We got open range up here. Bye, cows. Goodbye. There's a tradition in my family, and 
probably in others' families, that whenever we're driving around on a road trip or out anywhere, somebody says cows, the others say? Moo. Moo. I say cow, you say? Moo. Cows. Moo. Cows. Moo. Very good. Now you know. All right, we're just about back to the trail. We have one more little tunnel of aspens to go through. Yep, sure enough, we're at 5.99 miles. You can see on here. Maybe. <laughs> yes, yeah, six miles, and it took us five hours and 20 minutes. That was with a lot of time to stop and take pictures, mm -hmm. which we're gonna show you here at the end. Uh, by the way, Steve's shooting with the Sony A7R 4 mm -hmm. With which lens is this? Uh, 17 to 28. The 17 28. And I've <clears throat> been using the Sony A1 with the 2470. And uh, I think it was a lovely, a lovely walk. <laughs> mm -hmm. Moth, uh, thanks for coming along with us. Enjoy these photos while we go eat some ice cream. Yeah, ice cream sounds good. Yeah. Bye. See ya. Okay.